Are you a cyclist and do you have knee pain? Today we're going to demonstrate some exercises to help strengthen the muscles to support and stabilise around the knee. So if you've got pain around the front of the knee, um, sometimes known as anterior knee pain or patellofemoral pain, um, these are some of the exercises um, that you can do to help with ESO symptoms. So the first one we're going to do is demonstrate a mini squat. That's designed to help to strengthen this VMO, this inside muscle, um, part of the big quadriceps muscle at the front of the knee. So, um, feet hip distance apart, and then you're just going to do a little mini squat down, and then coming back up. So when you're doing this as an exercise, just make sure that your knees don't drop in there, okay? What we want is to keep your knees in line with the second toe, and just repeat those every day, and repeat it until your muscles start to feel tired. Okay, the next exercise we're going to share with you is what's known as an IT band stretch. So with um, patellofemoral pain or pain around the front of the knee, or sometimes you get pain on the outside of the knee, um, then sometimes that is to do with a tightness down this IT band. So it's the IT band, you can't actually stretch the IT band. What you're actually stretching is the TFL muscle, which is the muscle at the top. So um, the way we stretch that, so you turn with that side against the wall, you step one foot in front of the other, and then you, so you reach up and over. So where you're looking for is a stretch at the top here. It's only a small muscle, um, so it's not gonna be a big stretch. You're gonna hold it for 30 seconds and do a couple, a couple of times a day. So I'll just show you from this way as well. So reaching up and over. Okay. So the next stretch we're gonna, the exercise we're gonna show you is one down on the floor to help to start to strengthen around the glute med, which is the bottom muscles. If they are a little bit weak, then that can lead to some tightness down this IT band, which then causes a muscle imbalance around the knee, pain around that knee, um, and it can cause pain on the outside of the knee too. So this next exercise is to help to strengthen around the bottom muscles. So if there's a weakness in this bottom muscle, then it can cause some tightness um, down through that IT band, which can lead to um, pain around the knee, so a muscle imbalance around the knee. So this exercise, I always say, um, try and do it if you can with your back against the wall, so you can slide your heel up and down the wall. So the reason for this is to make sure you are actually working your bottom muscles. A lot of people, when I get them to do this exercise, end up bringing their leg forward, and actually they're not working their bottom muscles, they're, they're more working the, um, the quads muscle, the thigh muscle. So keep it back, squeeze your bottom muscles, and then just coming up, and then back down. And again, repeat this till fatigue, so until this muscle in the buttock starts to ache. Once a day.